morning to you good morning to you we're all in our places with sunshiny faces this is the way to start a new day hey welcome to a brand new day that we have never ever seen before this is a gift from god we gotta know that don't think your alarm clock just woke you up don't think just uh you having to go to the restroom or whatever or something just woke you up it was only by the grace of god you gotta know that but today is november the 14th and this is own your power own your power we're gonna come this morning from my little broke down the bible promise book it's all tore up honey it's good stuff in here and it opened right up to laziness i guess this goes with owning our power laziness i had highlighted before so it says, and that ye study to be quiet and to do your own business and to work with your own hands as we commanded you, that ye may walk honestly towards them that are without and that ye may have lack of nothing. That is First Thessalonians 4, 11 through 12. I'm going to read that again. And that ye study to be quiet and to do your own business and to work with your own hands. As we commanded you, that ye may work honestly towards them that are without, and that ye may have lack of nothing. Man, that is powerful. The next verse we'll go down to under laziness, it says, not slowful in business, fervent in spirit, serving the Lord. Romans 12, 11. Not slowful in business, fervent in spirit, serving the Lord. Romans 12, 11. Honey, let me just tell you, that's speaking to me. That's speaking to me. We may want or desire something. And it's just a wish or a thought. Or maybe I could do that. See, I'm talking about me right now. The word of God just backed it up this morning. We got to be about our business. And I'm warming up my coffee in the microwave. So, you know, this is a interactive morning vlog on this morning walk in the light baby it's okay yeah so we can't be slow for the word of god says and that's the news i'll show y'all what's going on said don't be slow for <coughs> don't be lazy I know I'm the blame for that. How about you? Have you ever been slowful with things you're believing God for? I'm trying to set up my computers. So, y'all coming along with me this here morning. Amen. As I set up both of them. But, yeah. Mm. Speaking to me. We're in the beach room and my den on this morning. We get 
fix your whole right. I think that's fine. It's fine. Yeah, honey, it said don't be slowful. Okay. Didn't know I was reading that. But God does have a way that's mighty sweet. What the, what, what's the rest of the song? Y'all know any of that? The Baptist Church and others used to sing. Just lay your burdens right down at his feet. He knows the road. He knows the road. And he'll bear your load. He'll bear your load. God has a way. God has a way. That's mighty sweet. This is a 5 a.m. voice trying to sing a hymn. But baby, I do it. Okay? Because I love Jesus and I love old school hymns. I'm an old Baptist baby, born and raised. Hardwood floors and the pews. Mm -hmm. God, I receive your word on today. He said, hey, excuse me. Stop being slow for I got something for you. God is always speaking, but are we listening? Are we listening when, 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 that, when he speaks to us through his word, through people, places, things? We got to know. It's not always that audible voice, you know, going to dash through the sky. Oh, I am the Lord. I am talking to you. I have a word for you. No, okay. That ain't how my daddy come, I come through. He's like, look. I need you to tighten up. Go on in there. Open the book. Oh, no. I don't want you to do that book. That other book. I got something in there I'm trying to say to you today. And it's just soft, still words of coaching and flowing. Because we do understand that he is our father. Amen. He is our father. That prayer is just not... Just words, our Father, which art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. <sighs> thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Forgive our trespasses as we give those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. For thine is the power. Lord, forever. Amen. I hope I ain't say that wrong. So, God, we see, receive your words today. Thank you for being with us, for being for us, for seeing us through a whole nother day yesterday, all through the week, God. Thank you for allowing us to to. To, to hear your voice and your words that you're giving to us in this season, God, in this right now season. We will not be lazy. We will not be slowful. We will not sit back. We will not procrastinate. We will not just drag on what you have for us, God, because we know that you give us direction for us our season and for our moments god and at this time i just ask you to forgive us from leaning to our own understanding god who forgive us god for going our own way for being that strayward child that wants to do things our way knowing that you have a way for us and lord we ask you to just help our um disobedience God to align with you and to align with your devil you allow you we're going to continue this prayer we're going to continue this decree my alarm was going off as I was praying and decree declaring and decreeing and then something else popped up and an encouraging word for the day that's not what we're doing God we thank you for focus to where we will not be sidetracked we will not walk in disobedience we will not walk in frustration and lack and insecurity and slowfulness help us not to be lazy as your word told us on today 
Help us to seek you as never before for guidance, God, because you're directing our path. Even with things that we need to do with concerning the economy and getting our houses in order, God, order our step. Direct our path, please, Jesus. We thank you. We give this day to you even before the daybreak, God. We honor, we bless you. We thank you for what you've done and what you're yet about to do in our lives. We submit our way in our lives to you all the more in the mighty name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, we have the victory. You have the victory. If you know that song, sing it. Because you know, a hymnal and a song is always in order. As it pertains to me. Amen. And God. Because it's loving on God. Pastor was talking about in Bible study. He was reiterating last night. You know, loving what God loves and hating what God hates. We got to be in alignment with him. Amen. We got to be in alignment. We cannot be afraid to say no. We can't be afraid to say no to maybe people and places and things that used to have our time, used to have our focus and energy. And yes, I'm logging into my work systems. As we decree in, um, but yeah, we can't be afraid. And God, you already said that you didn't give us the spirit of fear, but of power, love, and a sound mind. So on this day of November the 14th, 2024, you can do one thing through Christ who gives you strength. You can do one minute. I have my handy dandy mirror. I'm talking to y'all and I'm talking to me. Hey, T, you can do all things through Christ who gives you strength. You got this girl, okay? You can, you will, you must. You are doing it. Stay focused, stay mindful. God has you. And you will not walk in the spirit of laziness anymore. Tighten up, chop, chop. We got things to do, girl. Step. Now go be great. You have to speak over yourself sometime. You have to speak, encourage yourself in the Lord. Okay. So, I think that's it. That's all. It's about 6, 18. And I want to go ahead and get this up for you guys. I love you. Thank you for being here. This is T checking out from Creating a Life You Love with T. Where we are creating a life we love together. Thank you for joining me for Thankful Thursday. Mindful Morning Meditation. And my flow. Oh, didn't show you the cup of the day. Hello, sunshine. Hello, sunshine. It's raining outside, but you should have the sunshine shining within you at all times. Okay, I'm going to go because I could just keep on talking to y'all because I love you guys. And I want, I want us to get this. I want us to win, but it starts in our mindset and what's in the mind comes out of the mouth. In the heart. So go be great. Make sure you have your subs your uh, notification bell on that you have subscribed to the channel. And thank you for being here. Hit the like button, comment, show some love. I love you. Go be great.